So welcome guys, let's start to create this model for carburetor cover in our KTS software. So here you can see isometrically of this model for the carburetor cover and at the bottom you can see a back view which is actually for rotated view of the carburetor cover and at bottom you can see that all orthographic views and dimension for this carburetor cover is given. So let's start to create this part in our KTA software. So go to KTA. First of all, open our KTA software. Go to Start. Go to Mechanical Design and Part Design. And give whatever name you want to give. Press OK. And now make sure to have this all plain because we are not using this plane to create our part. We are creating our actually one axis system. So create one point here. Which is act as origin and point x should be coordinate and our coordinate value should be 0 0 and insert an axis 16 to this point to go back to 16 and select this point as origin and now let's start to create this part so first of all we are creating this side so go to sketch positioning and select this jet wire plane origin at this point for integration is parallel to this line Creating this, we have to create one arc here. So we start to create this arc, and dimension for this arc is here. You can see it is 108. So radius value for this is 108. So drag this arc to somewhere here. Actually, height drop this from this vertical axis is given as let's make it properly vertical. Now, to this, to this total length for this is given as 125 give this total name make sure this link should be horizontal only total length is 125 make sure this should be coincident like this point and this point should be on same line and make this arc symmetrical to vertical axis and you come here and complete this sketch of this and trim this line this the line you want to trim go to operation type select this trim select this line this. now we have completed this to the sketch before going to pair command make sure we are in a part for you design object now select this pad, select this to this sketch and make sure what is distance for this. So pad value should be uh, for 50 because we are using mirror point exchange. And now we can see there are some draft values are given here. So the draft value for this is I would be draft. So we have to do the odd vertical faces should be drafted so go to draft command here so select this all vertical faces of this part this carburetor cover now give our stationary neutral element as this bottom and the value for this is 5 degree and get preview just check how it is coming 
actually and actually it is coming upside so reverse this direction and now you can see it comes perfectly now this part is created just one next we have to create Here you can see another part we have to make here. So for creating this type of pocket here, we are using boolean operation. So for creating boolean operation, go to insert, create one body, give here name and to give a name go to properties and feature name remove remove part now go to sketch positioning and make sure you are you are in remote part work object so this is my name create a point as this orientation parallel 56 and we start we have to create here Actually, we have to create here one we call ellipse. So let's start to create ellipse for this photo. This ellipse should be this. So create add along this horizontal axis and move some more to that. This we have to create. Distance from origin means vertical axis is coming half of 125 and from diameter of this is coming. So you can see actual dimensions. Dimension it is come as 10. Maybe it is value for this is come as 50. Delete this. This to value is 10. Now we can see this part is created for 50. can see this ellipse is fully functioning now exit this to the sketch working and create one play another plane here so go to plane and image make sure you have selected object from plane and select this x y plane and check here you can see the rx25 and ry7215 draw at an option for 50 from here so the base command like this from this to this 50 mm plane we have to create now go to this new created plane go to this position select this plane rotor point as this orientation should be parallel with this now create one another ellipse here the same as this is coincident to this horizontal axis draw like this And it should be coincide to here. And 
check all dimension so rx should become 25 Seventeen point five. And this is come at seventeen point five. And this is come at half of twenty five, like this. And you can see this part is created due dimension from origin. It is good to skip over there. Now, you watch multi section sorted here. So, this, this, now make it TV. Press OK. Now, right click to this remote part and go here. Remote part object. Select remove here and select this part. Now, you can see this material is. Remove properly. Just we are checking, making plain section here. Now this remove part is perfect. And now we have to give the part thickness. So actually, the part thickness of this part is given here. Here you can see a three unit uniform wall thickness. So before giving part thickness, let's make use some fillets here. So here you can see the fillets value are given. Seventy five and both and select this as first. Let you know let value or this unit. this first and now this this all is left you can look at this file Change position is so decrease some fillet value. You it is here as three. Now you can check this part is created. Just you know to go make this part do some thickness. So select go to shell command, select at bottom face and the in PDF you can see a 3 unit uniform wall thickness we should have to give so I'll give here 3 you can see a 3 mm part should be created here
make sure to do validations file and we have not given any details to here so make sure to do here also now they start to create next happy which we have got here so here you can see what many thickness we should have to leave to here so for creating this go to sketch again question and select the chat by plane origin and this one orientation is parallel to this line and cut this cut the by by cut apart by sketch plane in this visualization plane create one rectangle like a structure here and height is 1.5 and from here it is present at One mm, and make to coincide this part. Actually, this up to this we have to remove the material for so all this part is green. This two sketch is completed. Let's edit the two sketch workbench now. Go to sketch positioning again. Select this XY plane here and make projected point as this type should be parallel to this area. And now we are just projecting this one node, this inside line. So go to 3D projector element and select this line make sure to click double click here and you can select this all line do and select properly to this all line You see here we have mistakenly click this line. So further we are deleting this. Now this is remaining. Now delete this unwanted line which we have created. Make sure to do here also. Now we have created this sketch. Is it this two sketch or pinch? So this is act as a center curve, and this is act as our profile. Go to this slot tool here, command it, which we can. It is present in sketch based feature there, and select profile as this center curve as this. Now we can select profile center curve. We could twist. So actually it is not perfectly coming so we can use a different method to create this so first of all delete this one sketches here and now we are using a different method to create this part
for creating this slot go to sketch positioning and select this x5 plane to front as this orientation is parallel to this make it reverse now we have to just select this again this profile project this online this line also okay so this to be sketch workbench we now use pocket command here select this sketch Do your some thickness and depth of this thickness make it here as well. Actually, our part thickness is three, and this is from at two, so here you can get two. Actually, we want one point and then tip press. So, make it your preview. Make it reverse here. Now, make it preview. You can see how much cut is done. Now, you can see this much cut is press. Uh, press off. Now, we have the proper cut here. start to make next part and here you can see we have to create this this boss like function here let's start to create this part for creating this just go to my game sketch position select this xy plane and make filter point as this notation is paired up to this line Now we start to create here part for creating this first we have to create one circle here. Radius of the circle is four. Make sure to change here as your radius and the distance from center is present and Make sure this should be center realigned. Like this it is present at eight mm. Now create one two lines here and this, this this line should be tangent here. Create another stream line on other side and delete these two lines. Use quick trim command and delete this inside circle also now do dimension to this all
now over this two sketch is fully quench made now edges these two the sketch were quench make sure what value we have to do so our plane is here so minus 3 we have to do first to go to pad on and here select this make it reverse direction here we have to do minus 3 not minus 3 just 3 we have to do here Give dimensions up to this overall means up to surface and select this as a surface. Actually, it is not coming, so just give dimension. Left up to this I make sure to select the up to next. Give dimension first of all, increase up to 20 minus 50. Yes, minus 50 you have to do. And now check where this pad is coming and go to here. Select this pad, right click to this. Go to pad object and insert in new. And right click to again here. Go to assembly and change here you to union tray. And go to here faces to remove and this face should be removed. This means this all. Okay, okay. Now you can see this part, this extra material we have. Remove by using this union trim command. And only last part is remaining guys. We have to give our one hole. And the hole size is 3 diameter and 12 mm depth. So go to hole command here and select this face. Make sure this is properly aligned hole. If it is not properly, so go to one position sketch again. And just go to constraint and select this and this and make it concentricity. And now it is the two discrete workbench. And now we have you know the diameter of this is 3 and depth value is 12. So you press OK. Now you can see that our this carburetor cover is ready and we designed as per our requirement.